What up, what up, Winbush here. And if you're working in your viewport when using the motion design tools and you wanna see the transparency, similar to how you would inside of After Effects, let me show you how to get that activated. So first, we wanna activate the motion design tools, which we're gonna come up here to edit, come down here to plugins, and we're just gonna type in motion. And then right here, we're gonna click on motion design. But before we hit restart, we wanna activate one more thing, but it's not a plugin. What we wanna do is come up here to edit, come down here to project settings, and then I'm gonna click on all settings here and inside my search bar, I'm gonna type in alpha and right here under post-processing, we wanna look for enable alpha channel support and post-processing. By default, it's gonna say linear color space only. We wanna select this and then down here where it says allow through tone mapper, we wanna select this. Now down in the lower right hand corner, it's gonna say restart in which we wanna click on that. Now it's been in my experience, sometimes it has to recompile the shaders, so please take that into consideration once you restart it. But once it's done, I'm just gonna exit this out, come over here to selection mode, come down here to motion design, and then I'm just gonna activate the motion design tab here as well. And I wanna look through my camera before anything else. So I'm gonna come over here to create default, and I'm gonna spawn everything in here. And now I'm looking through my camera in which if I come down here to where we have this box is red, blue, and green. I'm going to left click on this is post process effects. And then down here, you'll notice that it says checkerboard. And this is going to be how we get our alpha channel within our viewport when working with the motion design tools. And it's as simple as that. You just want to make sure you activate the tone mapper when you're working inside the motion design tools and you'll be able to get that checkerboard, AKA the transparency. So if this did help you out, make sure you leave me a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And until next time, stay fresh, keep creating, and I'll catch you in the next video. I'll see you soon. Take care.